to get this impeachment deal through because uh, because Trump's the argument that Trump is interfering with a political rival uh, has even less saliency when Biden isn't a political rival. In other words, if he gets knocked out before Iowa because his numbers are so soft and he's broke and he can't raise money, uh, then in a sense he hasn't ever been Trump's political rival because he never even made it to the first caucus. So your argument is they have to keep him going long enough to uh, to, to ram impeachment through. Right, and it's got to be a pretty hard job for him, but I think that's what he's there for. <laughs> yeah, I, I actually think you're, you're... I hadn't actually thought of it like that, but the argument... Because right now... Uh, I don't even buy this argument that that that, that Trump is interfering with a um, w with a political rival because it, he 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 was even if you accept all the quid pro quo thing the quid pro quo he's asking for is about Hunter Biden uh, and Hunter Biden's business activities in Ukraine and Joe Biden had no business activities in Ukraine and Joe Biden has gone around boasting. He had no idea what his son was up to in Ukraine, and according to which of his inconsistent stories you believe, he didn't even know uh, that uh, Hunter was on the board of any companies in Ukraine. So it's actually it's actually a stretch as it is uh, to say that this is something to do with a political rival, and it and it becomes even more of a stretch if the guy doesn't even make it to Iowa and New Hampshire. Do you think he will make it to Iowa and New Hampshire, Alex? Um, it's hard to say. Um, you know, lots of people coming out. A lot of people I know don't like the Democrats in general. Um, but as a whole, I think that his, his job is just to see the conflict in, uh, or quote unquote conflict. Yeah. I yeah. think the Democrat voters in general would prefer a different candidate, but that's not the play of the, the Democrat upper class. <laughs> That's a good way of putting it, Alex. Let me, I'm going to try and figure this out, because you look at Joe Biden stumbling around. He doesn't know what state he's in half the time. Uh, and it may well be <laughs> that this was, he was just told, get out there. Uh, we don't want to beat Trump. We actually want to impeach Trump and remove him from office before he even gets to November 2020. And the way to do that uh, is to put Joe Biden out there and then hang some impeachment thing on Trump over the, the Hunter Biden thing. That's a brilliant theory, Alex. Thank you, uh, thank you for, for making that. So he's got to stay in there. Brilliant. He's absolutely, he's got to stay in there.